Today is Amari Jacobs' first day of sixth grade at the King's Collegiate Charter School in Brooklyn. He's 12, a year older than most of his classmates, because he went through fifth grade twice. If Amari attended a traditional public school, he would be headed to seventh grade today. But King's Collegiate is stricter than most schools when it comes to promoting students. Not only do they have to pass state tests, they also have to score at least a 70 in all of their classes. During his first attempt at fifth grade, Amari fell short in one class, reading. Researchers have found that charter schools tend to have students repeat a grade at higher rates than the regular public schools. The retention rate at Democracy Prep, a charter school in Harlem, is similar to the one at King's. In 2009, 23% of Democracy Prep sixth graders were held back. Unlike King's, Democracy Prep holds summer school to help kids catch up and potentially pass the classes they failed. The school has a high proportion of special needs students, and the school's leaders say they often need the extra year. But every second of the day, the teachers and the administrators are looking at you and they're saying, is this person mature enough to go on to the 10th grade? Does, is this person mature enough to belong there? And that's our, you, that needs to be in the forefront of your mind whenever you step in here, is that I'm proving myself every second of the day. The research on strict retention policies has shown that it can be potentially damaging to students, however. Studies have found that holding back kids can lead to a higher dropout rate and lower test scores. But Rebecca Robinson, Amari's mother, is happy he repeated fifth grade. His grades have improved dramatically, she says. So now it's the first day of school, he's sixth grader. So I'm happy about that. I know he's good with me. He's prepared for sixth grade, better than he would have been last year. So that's what I'm most happy about. Amari says he didn't mind repeating fifth grade too much, even though many of his friends went on without him, and some of the material was easy. Next year, though, He's determined to move up with his classmates to seventh grade.